Hi, this is Sasha Segan from PCMag.com unboxing the new Galaxy S9 Plus from Samsung. Um, here's the S9 Plus box. You can see here's a list of the things we're going to find in the box. Uh, there's going to be a charger, a stereo headset, etc., etc. Let's take this out and see what we get in the package. Now this box is very much like previous Galaxy boxes. It really reminds me of opening up the box from the Galaxy S8. And here's our Galaxy S9 Plus. Now this is genuinely the first time that I have opened the box for the S9 Plus, so it's still covered in its plastic. But let's see what else is under it here. Here's the little tray. And now there's a there's a fast charging adapter. It looks exactly like the fast charging adapter that came with the S8 and for that matter the S7. Uh, standard USB plug here. Uh, pretty much any uh, Samsung fast charging adapter will work with this phone. It's uh, 5 volts, 2 amps. We have a USB connector here to give you a USB A to C and that's in part uh, to let you transfer files and let you transfer settings from older phones. And then under here, we've got our we've got our USB A to C cable. And then we have the AKG tuned earbuds. And once again, these seem to be very similar, if not the exact same, as the earbuds uh, from the Galaxy S8. And in fact, they may be exactly the same as the earbuds from the Galaxy S8. Uh, you have some uh, volume controls here. And of course, it uses a standard headphone jack because the Galaxy S9 has a standard headphone jack. Then uh, you have some extra ear tips for your earbuds in case your ears are not the size that the ear tips uh, came for. So now let me take the plastic off the Galaxy S9 Plus and off the front. Get rid of this bit. Get rid of all this stuff here. And I'll power it up. There we go. Now it's a Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus obviously powered by Android. And you can see we have a 5.8 inch screen here. And on the back, we have our uh, dual 12, meg 12 megapixel cameras. One of them is a 2X zoom. They have that new, uh, the main one has that new uh, mechanical uh, shutter where you can stop it up from f2.4 to f1.5 in low light. And you notice that the fingerprint sensor has moved to below the camera. Now let me compare that with some other phones here. For instance, here we have a Samsung Galaxy S8. And uh, you can tell that, oh sorry, this is the S9 Plus. That's the 6.2 inch screen. I know I said 5.8 inch screen earlier. That is the size of the Galaxy S9. This is the S9 Plus, which is the 6.2 inch screen. Uh, this is the Galaxy S8, which has the 5.8 inch screen. Uh, but you can tell here that the Galaxy S8 has the single camera. The regular S9 also has a single camera. That's one of the big differences with the S9 Plus. Also, uh, they moved the uh, fingerprint sensor location from next to the camera to below the camera. Uh, the Galaxy S8 also doesn't have that shutter that stops up to f1.5. Now, of course, this phone has not been set up yet, so we're just getting the start screen here. But let me also show you comparing the bodies of some other competitive phones. Here we have the LG V30S ThinQ, which has a six inch screen. And here's the backs. You can see the uh, you can see the really shimmery color on the LG as opposed to the black of the Galaxy. Of course, the Galaxies come in various colors. We just got a black one. Uh, a lot of people like this fingerprint sensor location more. Now the LG has a wide-angle camera rather than the 2x camera on the Galaxy. And then over here, we have your iPhone 10, and the iPhone 10 also has a 2x camera. And I'll turn them back over. You can see we've got a bunch of black slabs here. This is the way phones look today. 
And now on the bottom of our Galaxy S9 Plus, you can see the USB-C port, you can see the headphone jack, you can see one of the speakers, this phone has dual speakers, one of them fires down this way, one of them is in the earpiece and fires out towards you. Um, on the top, there's the SIM card slot, and that is also a micro SD card slot. It can take 400 gig micro SD cards, unlike this guy, no micro SD cards for the iPhone. And then we have, then we have the power button on the side, of course, and yes, there's still a Bixby button. Samsung has doubled down on Bixby. Bixby is not going away, and in fact, there are a bunch of new Bixby camera modes in the Galaxy S9 and Galaxy S9 Plus. So that's the unboxing for the Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus. As you can see, we haven't set it up yet. We're going to set it up now. We're going to play with it. We're going to check it out. We're going to review it. And you can find more interesting stuff about the Galaxy S9 on PCMag.com.